If you watched the Celtics last night, you no doubt saw Rhode Islander Doris Burke as part of ESPN's broadcast. I caught up with the former PC basketball star ahead of her introduction into the Basketball Hall of Fame this summer. She's a fixture at all the big NBA games. I asked LeBron James to critique the worst aspect of his game. Rhode Islander Doris Burke is almost universally adored in her profession and rather popular amongst fans, players, and coaches. Burke is currently the sideline reporter on ESPN's top broadcasting team and new this season, a full-time NBA game analyst, the first woman named in this role. A broadcasting pioneer, she's heading to the Basketball Hall of Fame this September, earning the prestigious Kurt Gowdy Media Award, a long journey from calling PC women's basketball games on radio. Well, the mere fact, if you saw me as a player uh, or coach at Providence, I was painfully shy, so the idea that I do what I do for a living is just remarkable. And, um, you know, I've saved one article ever written about me, honest to God, it was by Bob Ryan. And Bob Ryan has won this award for the Hall of Fame, so... Uh, I can't. I'll cry if I think about it, so I'm not going to think about it. Now, if you asked an NBA coach about in-game interviews, they'd probably compare it to a root canal, but not with Burke. I mean, you don't envy me, Yanni, in those moments? <laughs> no, I do. I, I like the stage that you're on for sure. <laughs> the stage is pretty good. Listen, if it's Greg Popovich, know that uh, my heart is pounding. I'm scared to death. I'm nervous, and I'm trying not to give that away. Coaches give you very little. Mm. Some just do it in nicer fashion sure. than the others. And in her role, Burke gets to narrate and conduct some of the biggest interviews in the profession. Those are, I don't want to say career-defining moments, but interviews that will go down in history. You interview LeBron after he wins a championship. Those are big moments. You know what? They have been probably some of the more memorable moments. I do prepare, Yanni. As you can imagine, I don't want to let the fan down. I don't want to let history down. We're trying to document the brilliance of these men in their career. And Burke's hectic schedule will taper down after the NBA Finals, just in time for a summer in the Ocean State. I love the beaches. I love water fire. I love everything about the state of Rhode Island.